Hey guys, it's Vanessa here. Welcome back to another video. Today's video is a little bit different. I decided to experiment using aloe vera in my hair for 24 hours just to find out basically what it was going to do. Okay, I know already that aloe vera is really, really moisturizing. I've and I've used it in the past quite a lot alongside other you know products, but I've never used it this way in my hair. And I just thought, yeah, why not try it and just see what what's gonna happen? And I was pleasantly surprised by the result that I got. Like when I tell you the results are just insane, like it's gonna blow your mind. See, see, like I tell you just keep on watching okay just keep on watching so you can find out now the first thing that we're going to do is to prepare our aloe vera now my aloe vera I get it from my regular Afro-Caribbean food store here in the UK that's where I get you know all of my African groceries and things like that they usually have it you know readily available but if you're not um, in an area that has that you can purchase it from Amazon if you're in the UK I don't know so much about other parts of the world but you know I'm pretty sure you can find aloe vera pretty easily so I'm going to use a whole aloe vera plant here guys because I have quite a lot of hair and I wanted to make sure that every single strand of my hair was covered with this aloe vera so that's why I'm using the whole plant but you can use less if you want to or use more depending on you know how much hair that you've got so I cut my aloe vera into like you know smaller pieces just so it's easier to work with and I decided to soak it in water for you know about 15 minutes now I did this because aloe vera can be quite itchy okay I didn't want to have this thing in my hair for like you know the whole day and the whole night and be scratching myself up and down everywhere so that's why I was like you know what we're gonna do everything that we can to avoid this from happening because I knew that if this happened I would be very very tempted to go and wash my hair um, so and it actually worked out perfectly well so soak it for a few minutes and then you know um remove the sharp edges scrape the gel out i didn't really show so much how i do this because i do this so much in my videos so you probably already know how to get the gel out of aloe vera so i decided to just pop that in my blender to blend it and that's pretty much what i ended up with guys now i'm going to go ahead and strain it i'm using um you know uh what's it called a wig cap this is one that i've used you know in other diy so that's what you can see it's got some stuff in it uh i couldn't seem to get to get it out so i just used it again uh, but i think that was probably <laughs> where the mistake came from as you'll find out later on in the video so yeah i just decided to just train it so i wouldn't get aloe vera pieces or pop stuck in my hair afterwards um so and then basically that's that's all I did and then I use I think I used like two balls to do it because you know one ball just wasn't enough because it was foaming um, so yeah that's pretty much it and then you're ready to just apply this to your hair now I didn't want to mix this with anything else I just wanted to use just the pure aloe vera plant because I really wanted to find out what this can do i've used aloe vera in my hair in i mean in the past so many times and i usually use it alongside other things like an oil um so i just thought you know what i'm just going to use this alone by itself this time just to see exactly you know what i get and when i tell you guys i was literally blown away like i was blown away when i tell you you guys know i always talk about aloe vera like so much in my videos um but yeah i'll definitely suggest that you try using aloe vera this way if you haven't already trust me trust me on this one i tell you trust me you are definitely going to like it unless you know you're allergic to it or your hair hates it like you know some people um experience um but if you generally like aloe vera your hair generally likes aloe vera you're definitely going to like this so i'm now going to ahead and applying this to my hair guys my hair is pretty dry as, as you could see um so yeah but it's clean though like it's been washed conditioned um but i just left it you know for a while to be honest we're all at home nowadays and i barely do anything to my hair these days to be honest so that's why sometimes i just look a bit crazy but hey that's life that's reality okay we're not going anywhere we're all stuck at home um so 
<laughs> yeah so i just decided to just pop this uh, apply this to my hair as you can see i'm making sure that every single strand of my hair is covered guys like you need to cover the whole hair and also massage that to your scalp because aloe vera has amazing properties when it comes to you know hair growth or stimulating hair growth so you want to make sure that you apply that to your scalp as well and just repeat that for the rest of your hair now the part that i did guys i just decided to just twist it and, did, and just do a, like a little bantu knot i like to do that just because it's easier to contain my hair and also um to prevent like you know the actual juice like drooping for my face when i'm working on the next section um so yeah that's pretty much all i did and i just kept on doing that for the rest of my hair pretty much love doing this so much on my hair guys that i was like you know what where has this been all my life like you know deep conditioning overnight i think is the best thing you can ever offer your hair like no jokes because it's just i don't know it's just it's just great obviously i didn't really like you know the wet feeling like you later find out in the video um yeah i just didn't like having my hair wet you know all night all day and all of that but the benefits are just yeah are just tremendous pretty much um so i probably would do this once a month um just to you know give my hair some extra moisture i think this is definitely amazing uh, you know if you're trying to get to grow long and healthy hair because aloe vera has like amazing hair growth benefits so leaving it in your hair overnight imagine like the goodness that you're providing your follicles with for a long period of time you know it's so much better than your actual like regular conditioner that you can get from like you know the store and you're not even sure of the ingredients that that's in it you know because the names are just so over complicated um so this is yeah definitely like you know amazing because it's all natural and you know it's not really going to do your hair any harm um so yeah it's just great i really loved it and yeah that's one thing that i would consider doing if my husband doesn't mind <laughs> you know the wet feel of my hair overnight <laughs> so at this point i was done guys and i just decided to just you know apply some gel that i had left over on my edges and you know the rest of my hair and that's pretty much it so i'm now going to go ahead and you know put on a plastic bag i haven't got a heat cap like i mean if you've been watching me from before you know i don't use one i always use these plastic bags and they do an amazing job still um so i used two just so i could secure it really well and then I tied it with a scarf as well because I knew that it was going to drip like it would have started dripping anyways so I was just hoping that you know this scarf was going to be able to retain you know the water that was coming out of my hair um, but I mean it was okay for a while and then it just got saturated so I had to like put another scarf on top as you'll find out later in the video guys i did not record this because it was you know a bit late at night when i actually realized that oh this is actually pretty wet I, I could start you know feeling that wet feel on my skin and i just didn't like it so i just yeah tied it again with another scarf and i just went to sleep left it overnight and yeah i'm just going to show you what my results are in the morning morning guys this is the next day i look really crazy right look at all this on my head <laughs> um the reason why i put this here is because it was leaking over you know the first one that i had so i just had to like put another scarf on top just to you know collect all the water that was coming out excuse me if you can hear my daughter um so yeah this is the next day so let's take it out i look crazy um but let's see what it looks like you know it would be kind of interesting to know look this is wet as well like <laughs> oh my gosh you can see look at how wet my scarf is see that 
so it was leaking and I had to do something about it so oh okay okay this is the scarf guys that's pretty wet it seems like my edges are dry oh wow it seems like it's dry but it's soft still I guess that's probably where the scarf has been oh my gosh oh my gosh the softness is unreal can you see that guys really soft like crazy I'm just twisting this again because it started to unravel so oh my goodness it looks it feels so good so I'm gonna go ahead and rinse this off now see that guys oh wow I'm getting some kind of chaos okay okay cows I can see you it's very moisturized like extremely moisturized I wish you could feel it really soft my curls have opened up actually which is very good so detangling will be a lot easier on me which is amazing hey guys this is me I have come back after washing my hair and this is basically what the hair looks like you know um, it's still a little wet and you can see it is still dripping one thing I would say is that I'm so happy with this result like it's just amazing look at how moisturized my hair feels obviously you can't feel it but you can certainly see how moisturized is looking it's looking so good I don't know what what this is it seems like it's like you know a bit of aloe in my hair I'm not sure um, but I'm sure it will come out when I comb it it shouldn't have done this though because I strained it that means that a uh, wig cap I'm using is probably not as good anymore the holes are probably bigger because if you let through some of the aloe gel I mean some of the aloe stuff then that means it's not good but hey anyways I don't really mind I'm gonna comb it out and it will all come out but take a few seconds just to appreciate the softness like look at that look at how soft my hair is looking I do hope that you've enjoyed watching this kind of experimental video this is the first time I actually do something like this on this channel um, so let me know what you think and if you like it let me know also if you would like to see more experiments on my channel I'm just kind of you know want to like switch up my content a little obviously not like saying you're not gonna get your hair content because you will still get your hair content and your DIY and all that but you know it would be nice to try something new and let me know what you think about it if you want to see more of it and on that note I'm gonna love you and leave you this is it for me today guys I hope you've enjoyed watching today's video and if you did don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and also subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed and I'll catch you in my next video which will be very very soon so thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you next time bye